if you're new around here it really does help my channel a lot plus you don't want to miss any of the fun videos um another thing that we did was we checked in on the goals that i made for january for 2023 <laughs> i don't want to talk about that in this video but we did check in on those goals or some of them i think uh we made a whole new set of things like self-destructing books, five-star predictions, things of that nature. And also going forward, I think in, no, it is July, I'm just kidding. So in August, our first, like the end of the month, we're gonna do this like most anticipated for the first time ever on my channel, which is basically where I just shop my shelves, all my shelves. Some are now in my bedroom, some are in here. It's cool, I got books everywhere, but I just shop my shelves and I pick 10 to 20 that I'm really in the mood for that sound like I would love to read them right now. And then, the following week, or maybe a couple days later, because we are doing beta, uh, I will play my game and hopefully be able to pick some of the books that I'm more in the mood for. I just think that'll be more helpful in helping me pick my TBRs because I am a huge mood reader, but when I pick my TBRs, I did change something on my TBR game too, where if I hit a prompt that says out of comfort zone, I can give you a couple of options and what I'm feeling right now, but as long as I fulfill that prompt, it doesn't matter if I read the right book that I put up. I hope that makes sense. That way I can still be a mood reader, but also play my game because I really love playing my game. But. In August, we have, you know, the like most anticipated shop with me type of thing or shop my shelves. Ooh, that's a good one, shop my shelves. There's checking in on tools, there's 
since we went through all my books and I unhauled like 65 of them, sorry for spoiling that for you, but I unhauled a good chunk of books that only is fair that I get more books, you know, like of course, so there will be a book haul during Theta. And uh, yeah, it'll just be like a whole lot of fun. This is more of just a chill video, kind of introducing things. I haven't quite finished filming everything for Veda, so I'm not entirely sure. I think I still have like a week of Veda to film, and then I still have probably 10 days a beta to edit plus the week well no it's probably like seven that i need to do plus the week so i'm like halfway kind of uh so i'm not entirely sure what all the videos are myself in present day but i just thought i would come up here and introduce you know beta i love challenging myself and to be honest with you i hit a huge reading slump in june and you guys should already know this. And then I kind of missed a week or two of uh, filming in July. And you know what? It felt really good to not have to worry about <laughs> this. I mean, I love doing this. But sometimes because I, I make sure that everything that I do, I put my full heart into. I'm so passionate about everything that I do but sometimes it's a lot of work and I just I'm gonna have to go back to work very soon I'm a teacher so I get summers off I get summers off I mean I don't because I do PD over the summer professional development I <laughs> got all my stuff ready all my ducks in a row for second grade because i thought i was gonna be in second grade so i made all these materials and i bought all this stuff that i don't think is gonna work for fourth grade but i'm a fourth grade teacher i'm getting moved to fourth grade what that's crazy uh it still hasn't fully settled in like it has and I get it and I'm not upset about it anymore <laughs> but yeah no I've just had a bunch of stuff happening uh so then of course I wasn't gonna do Veda I was gonna just let myself have an easy year ish and not do any crazy challenges but then my husband had to challenge me to uh doing beta and i'm like you don't even pay attention to my channel and he's just like yeah but you should do it you always get so creative and you always love it and <sighs> he's correct i do love it but at the same time do you know how much work he created for me? So, if you don't enjoy Veda this year, blame it on my husband because he's the one that challenged me to do it. And something about me is that I will take any challenge and stride with it, or try to at least. So, I am super excited for Veda. I know I got a little off topic, I'm sorry, that's just me. I'm very chatty and <laughs> oh my gosh. I think that means that it's time for me to uh, go. I hope you stick around for beta. Like I said, a video every day in August. And there's some really fun things going on. So don't worry to like this video and subscribe so you don't miss any day of videos in August. Bye.